Hey guys and welcome back. Right. Um, we tried to do the Deep Roads quest, wasn't we? So... are almost done building a lift to the deep roads. No dark spawn trouble yet, but the earthquakes have been brutal. I was told to meet a shape of Volta. She's waiting below. You won't see an Orzammar dwarf on the surface. They have rules about that. How many quakes have there been since you arrived? Uh, at least three big rumblers. And the aftershocks are nothing to sneeze at. My feet miss solid ground. Josephine's report mentioned several Lyrium mines were damaged by the quakes. You'll see what's left of this one on your way down. From what I hear, the other mines are barely holding together. So you haven't seen any dark spawn up here? I sharpened my arrows just in case, but they never showed. I'm okay with that. <laughs> yeah, I'm sure you are. From your tone, I'd guess Orzammar isn't your favorite place. I don't have an opinion. Cloud gazers like me aren't allowed in the city. The lift's ready for you. I thought that was Bianca then. No walls, fence, nothing. Try not to shift around and keep back from the edge. It's a long way down. <laughs> and that was quick. This reminds me of a story. Shocking. <laughs> it's about an impossibly handsome dwarf and his friend who got crowned King of the Nugs. A Nug King, really? It's not as good as it sounds. Nugs mostly just shit on the floor and roll in it. Oh. Welcome to the Deep Roads. We should be wary of Roy Lyrium. I'm more worried about finding Darkspawn. <laughs> Neither is a pleasing prospect. Always wondered if I'd die down here. You're not dead yet. The day's just starting. Wow. Somebody's gloomy. That got really dark really fast. will not be forgotten. You must be Shape of Ulta. A trust for La, Inquisitor. The Shaper, it welcomes you to the Deep Roads. You look as though you're hiding from something. As a citizen of Orzammar, even a glimpse of your sky could cost me my position and render me castless. Gotta love real dwarves. Mm. What does a Shaper do exactly? We chronicle the life and times of our people. Your historians. Also scholars and genealogists. Shapers preserve knowledge in the memories, an archive in Orzammar. We record memories in Lyrium to ensure they never fade. We must be meticulous in every detail. A difficult task. How many dwarves have you lost? More than we can count. The mining caste has suffered greatly. Our situation has worsened since we contacted Skyhold. The quakes collapsed this mine and shattered a seal, keeping the darkspawn at bay. The Legion of the Dead hasn't been able to mend the broken seal, and we can't afford to lose any more lyrium. What will happen if we lose more lyrium mines? The surface needs lyrium for all sorts of magic. The Inquisition more than most, I understand. And Orzammar's economy relies on the lyrium trade. Without it, there will be chaos above and below. 
Orzammar deals with Darkspawn all the time. Why request the Inquisition's help? The Legion isn't prepared for this level of disaster. And the Grey Wardens haven't answered our calls for aid. Any threat to the flow of Lyrium requires immediate response. The Inquisition is the only force we can rely upon. Yeah, I kind of killed most of the Grey Wardens that were left in the south. Sorry about that. I felt like crap, by the way. I didn't like it. Some did survive, but now they're going to war with the main... What, what would you say? Their version of headquarters? In what? That? Weishaupt? Weishaupt? I don't know. But it's all a big mess. They won't be answering anyone for a long time. The Inquisition stands ready to aid Orzammar. Without a steady Lyrium supply, things on the surface will get even worse. Apologies for pushing you. I fear the damage that Tremor caused. Follow me to the Legion camp. Or rather you push me, then I get squished by that thing. Coming? I like it, it's like an extra member. Oh god. Okay. These roads are dangerous. That was unexpected, especially when my controller side vibrating. <laughs> oh, hello. Stay okay. Clear. To break the ogre's grab, use an ability with a physical effect such as stun, knock him back, or knock down. I have stun, but only if he hits boulders. Oh, I have this as well. Okay. Now what? What am I supposed to be doing? It's not focused on us. Now's the time to attack. What do you think we're doing? Am I supposed to be doing some sort of special move or something? Because I kind of am attacking. Am I not attacking properly? Am I doing something wrong? I'd never make it out of the deep roads. I'm sure you would find a way. If the ogre reached this point, the legion must be overwhelmed. Let us hurry. See, I don't know if I was doing something wrong then. She kept saying, he's distracted, now's the time for attack. I never stopped attacking. Was I supposed to do something else? I must have messed it up. I will never get used to the stench of Darkspawn. They corrupt everything, even the air. Thank Kriff for your saying's mates for that. That's the broken seal ahead. It is worse than I thought. Charge us to the tunnels! 
They look more like Dark Spawn from Dragon Age 2. Mate. Set the charges with those bastards breathing down our necks. Clear out the dark floor. Stand there casually. This is everyone. I tried my hardest to save everyone, but I'm not sure if I did or not. I hope I did. Inquisitor, meet Lieutenant Wren, a veteran of the Fifth Flight and one of the Legion's finest commanders. <laughs> Someone paid her to say that. I appreciate the help, Inquisitor. Collapsing that seal bought us time. Blighters had the run of these tunnels for days. Now they have a roadblock. He was in the Fifth Flight. How many deep roads are there? How deep do they go? They'll take you from one side of Thetis to the other, if you have a death wish. The roads once connected dwarven cities that were hundreds of miles apart. Then came the Darkspawn. Ren and I have been exploring this region, reclaiming it, but the work is slow. Mark the map, fight an army, mark the map, fall in a hole, and so on. I get the impression you two have known each other a while. Yeah. The Shaper had sent her to dig up some relics. Asked me to keep her out of trouble. That was three years ago. You can quit any time. Not when we still have things to fight about. Mm. They seem close. The Legion of the Dead has the Inquisition's full support. That's the best news I've heard since the Quakes began. Actually, the only good news. Oh. Looks like they can 
this. Take cover. You heard that, yes. The rhythm in the tremors? It's clearer, stronger, more insistent. I hear it. Doesn't prove a thing. These quakes are not a natural disaster. They're deliberate. There's an intelligence behind them. How could an earthquake be caused deliberately? We get plenty of natural tremors down here. These are different. She thinks she knows why. I found an ancient text during an expedition with Ren last year. At the time, it was just a curiosity, but now? The text describes giant creatures, called titans, living deep underground. They sing in the stone, shaping it. When these quakes began, I believe we heard that rhythm. I believe a titan is causing all this destruction. I've never heard of titans before. What else can you tell me about them? The text I found predated the first blight. Its pages had mostly rotted away, and there's no mention of the Titans in Orzammar's memories. Which tells you something. Orzammar is known for hiding and destroying past history, events, everything else. So, that doesn't really tell us anything. All I heard was an earthquake. How is it you and Ren hear a rhythm? Our people have a strong connection to the stone. We feel it in a way topsiders cannot. Shapers have great stone sense, and Valta's better than most. She never gets lost. You speak of the stone like it's more than walls. The stone is eternal. She was here before us, and remains after we die. But the stone isn't your god. We don't worship her, but we do respect and honor her. The stone makes us strong, and we return that strength to her when we die. It's difficult to express in words. In my experience, no explanation is too strange to consider. For all we know, that text you found was a bedtime story. We can't be sure until we find the source. The rhythm I sense in the quakes is emanating from somewhere far below. The stone will lead us there. And if it comes to a fight, that'll be our job. There's a lift at the side passage nearby. Ready when you are. And there's another war table. About. Most darkspawn are mindless killing machines, connected by the Blight. But emissaries are intelligent, and use magic. Wait, not the Architect? Oh! We never, I never found out what happened to the Architect. Is this what the Emissaries, is that what the Architect is, or what they call the Architect? Because he did say he was about to make more of himself, didn't he? Free the dark form so they can think for themselves. So, so this might be the outcome of my warden's decision. Shrieks. It had to be shrieks. I thought you'd be used to all kinds of dark spawn. Well, everyone's got their favorites. Favorites. Who 
Alright. Oh, that strange about it. Looks like our construction, but... Hmm. It's missing gears. We have to find them. It's our only way through. That gear will fit the door. Keep an eye out for others. The song is soft but hard to crack. I hear the words. I can't even taste them because I cannot say them. Maybe mother, maybe mother needs me to move my teeth. What? Oh my god! What the sod is that? Yeah, that's what I'm wondering. The words on every page on in this book have been crossed out, spidery scribbled notes fill the margins. Builders Towers, such an old game, not just the children know. Big cannot cover small, left moves right. Oh, this is scrubbing this game. Piece by piece. They'll never know, they'll never find what happens when the towers move. I found it, but I have no need for it anymore. I'm guessing we do have need for it though. Um, so, let's move all those to. longer than I want to admit. <laughs> it's great, Lisa figured it out. Ren, I'm sorry about Bernat. You served with him a long time. Uh, it was quick. And Bernat returned to the stone with honor. We should all be so lucky. It's all right to be upset. I'm too old to be upset. How could you be too old to be upset? Did that messenger who came through camp have any news about Orzammar? The food shortage. More riots. There's unrest from Dust Town to the Diamond Quarters. <laughs> Can't have the Deep Lords going hungry. I made sure your mother and brother are safe. That wasn't necessary. You're welcome. Did I talk every time I go down here? No. Well, there's some sort of activation point or something.
doing it your whole life, Inquisitor. He means that as a compliment. I took that as a compliment. You're famous. Even down here. Is it true you killed a dragon? Several. Magnificent creatures. Bringing one down is always bittersweet. I can't even imagine. Tell me about their teeth. Hmm? I've heard they don't all breathe fire. No. Nope. And their scales have different colors and patterns. Yep. Careful, Ren. I believe you're drooling. <laughs> I think just about anyone who saw a dragon would probably draw as well. Oh, really? Really? You put one on a ledge? Oh, that could easy, I could easily slip on that. Well, if this wasn't dangerous enough, I've got to go on a ledge here. I could fall off, right? There's no invisible walls in this game, is there? Don't slip. Don't slip. Oh, don't push me off. No! I had a feeling that was going to freaking happen. Shit. Fear the killing blow. We rest in the stone and pass our strength back to her. That's our reward. But the darkspawn defiled these soldiers. They can't return to the stone. They'd only weaken her. There must be some way to lay them to rest with honor. We can burn the remains. No. It's all we can do. A mug, enchanted stain, a rune attached on the side opposite. It reads Bodan and Sons, quality wares and enchantments. What? Really? 
Bodan as in Bodan and um, Sandal. Wait, it's a sons, plural. He had one, didn't he? Shouldn't it be Bodan and Sun? That's either just a sound catchy, or there's something going on there. Realize we're going down further and further underground. I don't like it. We're already underground enough for my liking. And I think we're, th we're three floors down from the ground. Lost a good soldier in the roads once. She fell down a hole. Found her three days later. Let's see. He loves this story. She spent a whole day telling us all the strange things she saw while lost. A golden longboat floating in the air. Packs of Hairless children hunting nugs. A giant skeleton on a throne. Was it true? <laughs> Never found out. She woke up the next day. Couldn't remember any of it. Either something fishy is going on, maybe, maybe magical or something, or she was just high. Um, let's look. Yeah, we're four levels underground. We still got another. Th sorry, we're three levels, not four. We're three levels underground. We still have another three to go. This goes down six levels. How far underground will we be? Seriously, keep your guard up. They'll use your tongue as jewelry. Ugh. I'll remember that. Mm -hmm. Fuck you, I must have the ledge. These ledges are more dangerous than freaking dark ones, eh? Hey? I've heard encouraging things about your progress topside. That you're bringing order to the chaos. That's what they tell me. We could use that down here. Well, we're trying. Oh my god, they look horrifying. Yeah. Cardall met the warden, but I never had the pleasure. Oh. Do you often see Grey Wardens? From time to time. They're a good bunch. Tough in a fight. Fearless. Any warden would say the same about the Legion. Hmm. It would have been cool to see some um, faces from Origins. 
if I remembered. I probably would have forgot his face even if I did meet him. Mother holds me when I sleep, warm, so warm. Her rhythm flows through my throat, burning until the minds and their fat, cruel hands are a distant memory. Hold is memory. I am the sun. The words came in waves. I will drown in them for her. This guy is messed up. On the lyrium experiments, looks like his results were inconclusive. Conclusive? He went mad. Go deeper. Only way down from here is falling. Not keen on that. I'd also like to avoid falling if we're counting votes. <laughs> there has to be another way. There was. I just wanted to check this out quickly before going down that way, and looks like it paid off because there's a cult there. I can't smell it. Oh, fabulous. This is going to go down well, isn't it? Ten shrieks to defeat. Don't let them lead you forwards. They're leading you to other dark spawn.
Put him forever. Bloody hell. That fight lasted too long. They just kept coming from out of nowhere. Two more ogres are in my way. The impression's done left. Fuck all. It won't let you save either, which is a pain. If I die, I'm, I'm probably going to go back to the very beginning of this. I hope not. What the hell was that?
we've been fighting this thing for 15 minutes, I think. <laughs> Feels like half an hour. Never stop attacking the mercenary. As soon as you stop attacking him, his shield comes up. His shields are fucking bloody. Get down. Oh, for fuck's sake. Fastball continue to come out until he's dead. Because this seems to be never ending. They have not stopped coming out once. Bloody hell. Oh my god, that was so hard. So unbelievably hard. It took so long. Those dark ones are going to stop coming until he's dead. So if it takes you half an hour or 40 minutes to kill it, the dark spawn won't stop coming. That's the last of those dark spots. Oh, thank God. Legion's in your debt, Inquisitor. Look at this, Ren. It's ancient. Maybe a thousand years old. Any idea who built it or why? This tig is on top of a lyrium mine. According to the memories, the mine was destroyed by some unexplained disaster. The miners must have used this lift to reach the lower levels. But we're not using it, right? If there is a titan causing earthquakes, it's down there. I found this book with the emissary. The pages are mostly ruined, but a few are readable. See this line? I awoke to the singing stone. Our kingdom trembled at the titan's hymn. That reference to singing stone. I've been told that raw lyrium has a sound. A hum. The mining cast follows it to find lyrium veins. They say it's the stone calling to them. Perhaps it wasn't chance that the quakes destroyed Lyrium mines. Is it possible the Darkspawn or their emissary could also hear the song? The stone would never call to those vile things. But that doesn't mean they can't hear her. Darkspawn live and die by the Blight. They don't care for much else. I didn't realize you knew so much about Darkspawn motives. Not everything's a mystery, Volta. Some things are exactly as they appear. And some things are not. He's part of the Legion of the Dead. Their job is to kill Darkspawn. So I'm not surprised if he knows a bit about them. If similar quakes happened then, the people who lived here may have found a way to stop them. I see no solution in the text, but it's practically dust. We're lucky any words survived. <laughs> Half a poem. Just what we needed. Perhaps this will change your mind. Look here. It's the royal seal of Orsic Garal. King Orsic Garal? That book belonged to a paragon? Maybe you are onto something, Volta. 
Of course you'd take a dead man's word over mine. Always the traditionalist. Hey, challenging tradition lost you a cushy position in Orzammar. Does a king's book mean that much to you, Ren? Paragons are the best of our people. They don't hand that title out to just anyone. Not even a king. Knowing it was Garal's book from the start would have saved us an argument. As if you'd ever avoid an argument. Mm-hmm. What does he mean, you lost your position? I thought you were a Shaper. Not all Shapers have the same duties. Mine were... adjusted. When my superiors ordered me to remove an official record from the memories, I declined. We decided it would be best if I served the Shaper it here, finding history instead of recording it. Or erasing it. That record must have been important to risk your position over it. It was trivial, actually. A cousin of King Haramount discovered that her husband's ancestor had Carter connections. But the truth is the truth, no matter how political it may be. The Shaperit can erase official records on the memories permanent. Sometimes erasing records is standard procedure. If a dwarf becomes castless, they're struck from the memories. But I was asked to change a fact that someone important merely found inconvenient. Exactly. So, even Carter should be struck. Yeah, I'd hate her job. I, I wouldn't want to erase anything. But I'll be thinking, screw you, tell me. If the Shaperit is willing to erase memories, what would prevent them from covering up the existence of Titan? Exactly. Why would they do that? Because someone in power demanded it. And they would do it as well. It takes courage to challenge authority. I suppose you would know. <laughs> it's a bit. Some believe the past is what we make it. But we gain nothing from ignoring mistakes. Wise words. Where do you disappear? Sorry, I brought it up. The earthquakes are what matters. I don't know where this lift leads, but we're about to find out the hard way. Get ready. Well, I don't think I'll be getting ready tonight. Um the Inquisition is on everyone's lips. Even the Assembly has taken an interest. In his younger years, King Haramont would have greeted you personally. But he is too old now for such a journey. How does one become a Shaper of Memories? I was born with a keen stone sense. It caught the Shaper's attention. But my passion for history earned me the title. It was never really a choice. You seem quite excited by the idea that these Titans may exist. My connection to the stone allows me to hear it, but I can only listen. Titans can sing through the stone. It is extraordinary. We call ourselves children of the stone. What does that make the Titans? Parents, I guess. What's life like in Orzammar? I haven't lived in Orzammar for three years, but I receive updates. Is there anything in particular you'd like to know? Do you miss living there? I do sometimes. Particularly the easy access to a warm bath and clean clothes. But the importance of my work outweighs the comforts of the city. How's the political climate in Ozamar? There have been riots due to food shortages, but they will pass, I hope. I've no doubt some Deshers will try to use the situation for their own gain. But the King has a good hold over the Assembly. What are Deshers? Members of the Assembly. All noble-born. Through the assembly, they govern Orzammar. The king presides over them. A dwarf's caste seems to dictate their entire life in Orzammar. I could bore you for hours about our society's castes and the tensions that go along with them. Simply put, citizens of Orzammar are born into a caste, and that is their lot in life. A member of the smith caste can never join the warrior caste, and vice versa. Everything is predetermined. There's no way for someone to change castes. It is possible for a member of the lower caste to marry above their station. But only their children's caste will improve. Similarly, when dwarves are made casteless, so are their descendants. That's enough about Orzammar. Of course. Thanks for the insight, Shaper. My pleasure, Inquisitor. We'll speak another time. These tomes were pristine before the Deep Roads. Shaper Seabor's going to kill me. You don't like him anyway. My... We'll speak in... A trust for law, Inquisitor. 
Thanks for the insight. Okay. Well, she's not saying anything new. Um. Well, looks a bit. What's that? Not letting me hover over it. Oh no, before I go, didn't I? I can't forget that. I completed. Didn't I open a new one? I swear I got a new one. Clearly seen action. Basically, someone smacks them around the head of it. Um, I've had this built so I can go down there and do whatever I need to do um, but before that I've been recording for a few hours now so I think um, it's best to stop here so after I've done this I'm going to check out what's down below then I'm, hopefully I'll find a cog because I'm missing one cog to open that door then I'll open that door and then I'll carry on down below and go down to the next level and see what awaits us there. Um, I've done every other map and all the side stuff at the moment except for this one and that one. Apart from that, the other two floors are all complete. And yeah. So yeah, I think now's good as time as any to um, stop it now. Uh, but I was hoping to get this all done in one video. But just like the last one, I don't remember this DLC being so big. But the, it's that fight I just had, it, I think it took about 15 minutes because they were just non-stop, just continuously going at us. Oh my god, that was effort. <sighs> but obviously we finished it in the end and got there. Um, I'm hoping this will take only one more video and that's it. I don't, I'm hoping this DLC won't take much more. It shouldn't do. If I, if I only got three floors, but I'm not, I don't quite remember what's coming next. I remember a couple of bits, but um, not much. Yeah. It doesn't seem like much to me, but then again, this whole DLC didn't seem like much to me and it's a lot longer than I remember. So, where I get to next time, I don't know. But um, if you're watching, thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time. Bye. What was that? <laughs>